Hey guys, today I'm going to be starting a series of UI table view tutorials. In this tutorial we will be populating a table from an NS array. Now this tutorial will be simple, but it's very effective in getting what you want in your table. So let's start by opening up Xcode. And create a new project. This time it'll be a navigation based project and hit choose. I'm just going to name mine table view and save it. Open up classes and resources folders and then go to rootviewcontroller.h. Now in rootviewcontroller.h, remove the table from UI table view controller type a greater than sign and type in UI table view delegate comma UI table view data source and then close that okay now inside these brackets we only need two lines of code and they are IB outlet UI table view controller or UI table view and call it table view or my table view and NS mutable array and let's just call it array okay this is all we need for our root view controller dot H let's go to root view controller dot M and uncomment view did load. Okay. Now to populate our array, to get our array going, type in array equals open bracket twice ns mutable array alloc close bracket init close bracket semicolon. Okay, now under this just type in open bracket array add object and I'm going to type in first and I'm going to do this again array add object second And one more time. Array. Add object. Third. Now, this is uh, your first row will say first, your second row will say second, and your third row will say third. Now, this is only for a demonstration. Um, you can put in whatever you want within the quotations, it doesn't matter. Okay, so let's go on down to number of rows in section. Erase the zero, open bracket, array, count. Okay, now go to configure the cell, and this is the part where we tell the cell what to display, like what text do we want the cell to display. So just type in cell dot text label dot text equals open bracket array object at index index path dot row close semicolon okay and down at dialic array release okay build that and it succeeded so let's go to root view controller okay and the first thing we do is delete the table view and we replace it with our own view okay just double click that to show your view and now look for a UI table view and drag it in the view 
connect the data source and the delegate to the files owner. And then right click or command click from files owner to view and make it view. Now click the files owner and make sure you have everything here. Also click the view. Make sure the class is root view controller and save that. I'm just going to save mine to the desktop. And quit interface builder to this. Well, let's just build and run and see what happens. Okay, so right now you have your first, second, and third. Um, if you want to add more, just go to uh, View Did Load and you can type in Array, Add Object, and just to show that you can type in anything, I'll just type in Test for this one and save it and building run and there's test if you would like a title in your navigation bar simply go to view to load one more time and type self dot title equals um, I'm just going to name it test save that once more And there's your test right there. Now you can add as many rows as you want. It is a table view. It'll scroll. Um, but now you know how to load cells from an array. Um, so if you like my videos, uh, please subscribe. I'll be making a lot more along the lines of a UI table view tutorial, such as custom cells and loading from property list and stuff like that. Uh, source code will be in the description, and as always, thanks for watching.